All right, so um, what were you aspiring to be as a kid? Was it always music or? Something else you saw. Mm. See, growing up, we always like you know had the little rap lunch. You know, what I'm saying everybody rapping. I never really thought about being a rapper until I turned about sixteen. You know, taking the, actually taking that shit serious. But um, how that shit came to be, really, is, you know, what I'm saying that shit just come up. You know, what I'm saying I wasn't even really worried about rapping. I was really worried about basketball and shit like that. And then I started getting around people who, who did music more, seeing my cousin do music and shit. So that's what influenced me to do it. Mm -hmm. So talk about the first experience like recording. Like what did it take for you to finally record your first song? <laughs> my first experience recording, I was actually, when this was when I was like 13, you know what I'm saying? I thought I was, like I said, we, we all have fun doing that little rap lunch shit, you know what I'm saying? But actually going in the booth, I thought I can just go in, like I'm Lil Wayne, you know what I'm saying? Going in that hole and just spell up top of the dunk. It was not that. <laughs> it was not that. But I had to learn how to start writing, you know what I'm saying? Take, when I started taking that shit serious, you know what I'm saying? Nobody want to hear the same shit over and over, so. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So what about now? Like, do you more so write or is it more freestyle now? Uh, I would say a little bit of both because I do like my songs are written, but I'll freestyle and I'll keep what I like, write it down. You know what I'm saying? Freestyle, keep what I like, write it down. That's how really how my music come about. Mm -hmm. What kind of sound do we expect coming from you? What kind of sound? Oh, I'm, I want to, you know what I'm saying? We turning up, you know what I'm saying? I do put a little bit, you know, a little season there of what I'm doing, you know what I'm saying? Everything I really rap about, you know what I'm saying? Real rap, no cap, you know what I'm saying? Everything in there, but I really go for the turn up scene, you know what I'm saying? Play my shit in the club, you hear me? Like, who's some of the artists that you're influenced by? It could be industry, it could be local. Uh, industry wise, <laughs> NBA. The only reason why I say that, because that little nigga, he came. I see you got the tattoo. Yeah, too. you know what I'm saying. That that shit never broke again. You know what I'm saying. It's not to jock his way. Even that that little nigga really did some shit. You know what I'm saying. I like the way his team was moving. You know what I'm saying. They was fucking with him, pushing this shit. That's what the team need to be. You know what I'm saying. That's who you surround yourself with. People who gonna push you. You know what I'm saying. And that nigga really never broke again. That's why I fuck with that little nigga. Real real shit. All right. So going solo, would you say that was a better move for you? Oh, way better. Way better. Reason being is because, like I said, I'm making these songs now. I'm doing it by myself. I'm showing people what I got. And like I said, people was out there, but even before, we ain't gonna drop your own stuff. You know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna do this. We ain't gonna do that. Hey, y'all want it? Here it go. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm dropping my own shit, doing my own shit. But I'm doing it the right way. You know? What's the right way for everybody that, that don't know? I'm taking the right steps. You know what I'm saying? Most people just jump out there, like I said, they wanna hop out there and do, jump on SoundCloud, YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to actually take the right steps. Dis distribute it right, you know what I'm saying? Get the visuals, get uh, cover art, single art, you know what I'm saying? Not just pushing everything out there. Well, I'm taking time, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm taking time with it. And was there anybody that taught you? Was Did Ralph like sit down with you and be like, yo, this is what you gotta do, this is what you gotta yeah, do? Yeah, most definitely, most definitely. He sat me down, he's, hey, like I said, when I, when I told him I wanna take this shit serious, like this rap shit, is, I tell everybody, this rap shit is all I got, you feel me? So he sat me down, you know what I'm saying? He tells me, hey, you got a good sound. So, you know, like I said, that's why he wants to push me. You know what I'm saying? Because he see that I'm serious with it. I sit down and I, and I get with it, you feel me? All right, so when you start coming out, uh, you just gonna hit us with a single or are you gonna hit everybody just with a tape, like boom, all right? No, I'm gonna hit everybody with a single. I'm gonna drop two singles, actually. Like I said, I'm, next week, already August 29th, you know what I'm saying? Ice, that whole dropping. And I got another song called 2020 Video Done, dropping, and then, I'll probably drop one more single, then I'm gonna hit them with the whole album. You think before the year ends or probably next year? Um, I would say a little bit more next year, probably somewhere towards the beginning of next year. Where do you see yourself in the next five years, you know, if you keep this rap shit going? Oh, I'm with the baby, you know what I'm saying? I'm with, I'm with so I'm, I'm chilling with a favorite artist somewhere, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm getting up out of Texas, you know what I'm saying? I see myself making major moves, for sure. All right. So, what uh, other than the two tapes, the other than the two the singles you got and the tape coming, like what else is next for you? Are you looking to do shows? Like, are you looking to pop pop out more in the city, be on scene and shit like that? Like I said, I ain't really doing it. Like, well, like I said, two one zero Texas born and raised. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing it for the city, but I'm not trying to focus. That if I can get that straight, you know, so I'm trying. To, I'm not trying to focus on just the city. I'm trying to go big with it. You know what I'm saying? Across the map. So you know, yeah. So when would you say you actually started listening to music and like hearing lyrics, feeling lyrics, you know, shit like that? Uh, I'll probably have to say listening to the lyrics probably like 13, 14. I started uh, 
I would say, yeah, I would start listening to uh, like Rich Homie Quan and everything he was rapping about. Like a nigga was really feeling that. I was really going through that. You know what I'm saying? Mama struggling and all that shit. That's really who I do it for is my mama and my kids. You hear me? What does music mean to you now? Like take away music right now, what do you have? Nothing. And the reason why I say that, like I said before, his rap shit is all I got. Growing up, going to school, I was the one always with the headphones in. I'm mad, I'm listening to music, you know what I'm saying? Sad, I'm listening to music. Whatever emotion, you know what I'm saying? Or I'm writing music. Like, music is a big part of my life. If there was no music, my, I don't know what life would be. You hear me? Real shit. Was there ever a time like you felt like giving up, like, you know, just fuck this shit, it's not going anywhere? Multiple, multiple times. Uh, the reason why I say that, kids, you know what I'm saying, regular life shit, and then you see, you know what I'm saying, there's a lot of talent, especially in Texas, you know what I'm saying, there's a lot of talent, there's a lot of people trying to get the same goal that I'm trying to get, you feel me? And <clears throat> if, if a lot of people are trying to get that same goal, you like, damn, you know what I'm saying, am I really hot, you know what I'm saying, am I really doing this? I, sometimes I feel like, damn, like, there's so many people in the world, like, why me? Why am I going to get this? And the, shit, you never know, you know what I'm saying? I used to be called the golden child growing up. I like making money, I hustle, you know what I'm saying? Money is part of my thing, music is part of my life, you know what I'm saying? My favorite thing, my favorite goal, one of my goals is to do, I've never been outside of Texas, you know what I'm saying? I've traveled inside of Texas, never been outside of Texas. I want to travel, you know what I'm saying? So what I got to do, I got to use my craft, you know what I'm saying, my abilities, and I'm going to use that shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to travel, what do rappers do? They travel. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They gonna show their music, they gonna travel, they gonna do what they want, shit. My only legacy is to be a rapper, you feel me? Something, they don't even gotta be a rapper. I ain't trying to make, you know what I'm saying, Fetty Wap money, you know what I'm saying, Grammy money, you know what I'm saying? Let me let me get a zero settlement, you know what I'm saying? I'm good, let me just provide for my family, and get, you know what I'm saying, live better, you know what I'm saying, do for my kids. Let, let my kids know, you know what I'm saying? You don't need no nigga for shit, you know what I'm saying? You already know how the game go. Niggas try to buy a female, you know what I'm saying? I want my daughters to look up like, nigga, you trying to buy me some shoes? You know what I'm saying? My daddy been doing this, you know what I'm saying? All this for them, like, this music shit is for my kids and my family, you know what I'm saying? That's what a real nigga is supposed to do. That's, the, that's, that's a real OG, you know what I'm saying? Do it for your family. Not to be showing off, you know what I'm saying, for some other niggas. Not to be, you know, getting clothes. You know what I'm saying? That's what niggas really do. And I think that shit gay, you know what I'm saying? Niggas want to get clothes and shit and all that. It, it's okay to look good, you know what I'm saying? Go look good for a female. Nah, niggas want to get new shoes and shit to show up to their next nigga. You know what I'm saying? Get clothes, get a car to show up. They don't even try to do it for a female. They do it for a nigga. I feel like that's gay. They want to go to jail just to have street cred. You know what I'm saying? want to be in there with a whole bunch of niggas. That's gay with their shirt off working. That's gay. You know what I'm saying? I'd rather go get some money fuck a bitch you know what i'm saying like you know it's, it, it, it's just how it is facts so what's that what do you think is going to be that point in time where you say i made it where i say i made it yeah it'll go back to my family when my mama good you know what i'm saying when my kids good when they ain't got to ask for shit when they come to me daddy i need this boom my, you know what I'm saying? We need this. Ain't no rent. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no seeing my mama cry, struggle over rent no more. That's when I feel like it made it fucked. This, you know what I'm saying? Hopping on stage and, you know what I'm saying? Whipping all the cars and shit. Yeah, that shit gonna make you feel good. But when I know my mama good, my brothers and my family good, when I know they straight ain't ever gotta worry about a rent, water bill, electric bill, car note, none of that, that's when I feel like I made it. Mm -hmm. And does your family, are they, do they have your back behind the music shit? Oh, 1,000, 1,000, 1,000. You already know, my mama be, you know what I'm saying, that's my biggest fan, you know what I'm saying? I don't care what it is, you know what I'm saying? I could be famous right now, my mama on front row, uh, you know what I'm saying, past, she's standing right there. Hey, my mama gonna be there for sure. All right, so other than music, what do you like to do? Other than music, I like to make money and take care of my kids, you know what I'm saying, my babies, you know what I'm saying, they, they the ones who got me here, you know what I'm saying, they the ones I keep hustling for, they the reason why I keep making music, like I said, it's, it's rap shit, is all for them, you know what I'm saying, it's really all for them, yeah, I do what I do, but everything, my, like my uncle told me, make sure everything that I do at the end of the day, I come home back to my babies. You feel me? So everything strictly for them. You know what I'm saying? Can't no nigga hold me. Ain't nobody going, you know what I'm saying? Can't nobody say nothing to me in front of my babies. My babies gonna know what it is. You know what I'm saying? They tell my story. When I'm gone, they the only ones that's telling my story. I, only thing I got left. You feel mm -hmm. me? And another thing, like you've been in the music game for a while. So you've been able to see like in the city who's, who's made it out and who stayed under. Like, do you feel like the city respects good music? 
Mm. Just judging off of who's hot, who's been hot, who's who's made it out, and who's <clears throat> do they stayed on the ground. Do they respect good music? I can't say that for everywhere, but in Texas, I'm talking about in, 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 San, 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 in San Antonio. Yeah. Okay, yeah, right. so in San Antonio, I feel like whoever's popping, whoever got the most popularity, whoever got the most shares of like, then that's when everybody come around. Oh, then, then that's your nigga. You know what I'm saying? It's not about because when you first start, ain't nobody gonna fuck with you. They just oh yeah, you bullshitting. And then you start, you know what I'm saying? Once you get them likes, people see you doing videos, people yeah. see you, you know, branding yourself. Then that's when they come. You know what I'm saying? Oh, then I fucked with them. You know what I'm saying? Oh, we went to school together. That's my bro. Then everybody wanna call you bro. It's about who, you know what I'm saying? Who popping? Who got the most names? Who out there? So what advice would you give any young artists watching right now? Any young artist, go do what you do. You know what I'm saying? Make your music. Can't nobody tell you shit. Don't let nobody stop you. You know what I'm saying? Keep moving. Because there's going to be people, you know what I'm saying, that ain't going to believe you. But once you make it, then they're going to be the ones with their hand out. You know what I'm saying? But you got to know. Ain't nobody, you know what I'm saying? The ones who, the ones who, the ones who, my bad, uh, the ones who really wish you well is the ones who really hate. You know what I'm saying? So you just got to watch out for them snakes and know when to cut the grass. You feel me? All right, so where can we find you at? What's your social media? Oh, social media, Magnus, Sav, Instagram, Facebook, you know what I'm saying? YouTube, Trill Salvo, all that shit. I'm also gonna have all types of links, all that shit, you know what I'm saying? 2020, Ice, we on the way.